Dock worker Jeanne Slipka, under impossible circumstances, saved people who were not considered people by the authorities and even his neighbours under German occupation. That required courage and friends. Being brave isn't easy. Being in the minority isn't easy. Hating and suspecting any otherness is easier. It takes no effort. But we want to live in a country where our fellow men and women are considered people. We would like our society to be brave, reliable and considerate, capable of cooperation and self-regulation, not expecting orders from above. We want to create a place in Riga for young people to gather and build resistance to automatic stereotyping and common, casually repeated, hateful myths. Civic courage is something to be learned, to be taught, to be trained like a muscle, like a racehorse. That is why the House of Courage will be a training ground for kids and young people in Latvia. Let's help lion hearts grow their courage and learn to deal with its consequences and side effects too. The House of Courage will be located right next to Janis Lipka Memorial on the island of Chipsala, an integral part of the Knowledge Mile that already incorporates several universities, business centres, museums and the National Library of Latvia. We are aiming high, but the target is well within reach. We want to be the springboard for a new civil society as it researches its history and brings courageous ideas to life, changing the world for the better. Everyone can lend a hand in reaching this aim. Donate to develop courage in the new generation and all of society. Donate to Lipka House of Courage. <laughs>